Good afternoon, good evening YouTube, Cuts by Dre, back in the building, New Styles Mobile Barber. Today I got something good coming up for y'all today. It's a new episode, a new series that I'm doing that I'm going to put in front of all of my videos in the future. It's going to be called Shop Talk with AI. All y'all know about AI, the talk about AI out here right now. Everybody's talking about it. Every industry is talking about it talking about how it's taking jobs from people, how it's going to affect the industry in the future, and it's, and it's going to cost so many people so much money. And they also predict it's going to predict that it's going to make a lot of people money. So today, my first episode of Shop Talk, Shop Talk with AR, I'm using Bard. It's a AI app from Google. You know, and it's, we're going to talk back and forth. We're going to see what AI got to say about the barbering industry and, and how we may have to adjust in the future. So we're going to jump right into this. You know, one thing that is doing right off the top, you know, it's like my co-host. So in a sense, it is taking jobs away from people because you, you, in this aspect, you don't need a co-host. I have an AI computer in front of me pretty much, an AI robot that can pretty much I'll ask it questions it'll answer questions it'll talk to me and it'll give me factual answers that I myself couldn't couldn't come up with on a drop of a dime couldn't think about or wouldn't be able to you know regurgitate actual facts that quickly so in a sense this AI technology will affect a lot of industries but will it affect will it affect our barbering industry we we're going to ask them some questions today, and we're going to find out. Then on the flip side of that, we're going to go into my next haircut review, and that's going to be a, a mobile cut, mobile cut in the barber van. So make sure you stick around for the second half of my shop talk, which is going to be in the van for my mobile cut. All right, so let's get started right now. Today, as you can see, I got my computer up. I got it logged in. I'm, I'm on Bard. If y'all haven't heard of Bard, it's an AI platform. You can log in. You can ask it all kind of questions. And today, I'm going to ask it a simple question about our industry. How will AI affect the barbering industry? And when you press enter, it'll calculate it. I put this question in briefly. And it'll even talk to you. So let's see what let's see what Bar got to say. Let's see what AI has to say about the barbering industry. It's processing. Artificial intelligence, I, is rapidly changing the barbering industry. Here are some of the ways AI is affecting the industry. Automating tasks. AI can automate many of the tasks that barbers do, such as booking appointments, managing inventory, and sending marketing messages. This can free up barbers to focus on providing better customer service and giving more creative haircuts. Okay. Personalizing services. AI can be used to collect data about customers' hair and styling preferences. This data can then be used to personalize the haircut experience for each customer. For example, an AI-powered barbering app could suggest haircuts based on a customer's hair type, face shape, and desired style. Providing training. AI can be used to provide barbers with training and education. This training can help barbers learn new skills, stay up to date on the latest trends, and improve their customer service skills. Mm. Creating new products. AI can be used to create new products and services for the barbering industry. For example, AI-powered hair clippers could be used to create more precise and consistent haircuts. Overall, AI is having a positive impact on the barbering industry. It is helping barbers to be more efficient, productive, and creative. It is also helping to create new opportunities for the industry. Here's Hey, I can press pause too. That's one thing I like about it. Hey. This AI thing is serious, man. I like I like some of the points that it's talking about. A lot of these things I'm using now, a lot of the things a lot of barbers out there are using right now. That's the barbering apps, the book your appointments, to notify your customers for specials that you might have going on, some deals that you might have going on your location, your website. So a lot of this AI technology right now, from what I'm hearing, we're already using. What's new though to me, it, it says something about some AI clippers. You know, AI clippers, you know, will be able to help get a better haircut. Now, I don't know 
when or if they are out yet AI Clippers but hey they come out I might want to check them out to see if it's possible that they will help my hair cut out and another question that I wanted to ask it, it it goes into more detail a little bit farther on you know let me let me let me let you hear a little bit more what it's got to say I, I put Specific it on pause. examples of how AI is being used in the barbering industry true lark true lark is an AI powered platform that helps barbershops manage their businesses the platform can automate tasks such as booking appointments, sending okay, marketing we talked messages, about that. and managing inventory. Definitely. Hairbond. Hairbond is a hair care company that uses AI to develop new products. Okay. The company uses data from customer surveys and social media to identify new trends and develop products that meet the needs of its customers. Artificial Barber. Artificial Barber is an AI-powered barbering app that provides personalized haircut recommendations. The app uses data from a customer's hair type face shape and desired style to suggest haircuts that will look good on them all right i mean that sounds good you know you got apps out there that may be coming out ai apps is going to help the customer tailor a haircut to their face shape i mean that sounds like something you know what i really want to know is uh will ai robots take over you know i'm gonna ask you that question will ai robots take over the barbering industry all right, it's processing. Let's see what it got to say. What? Let's see what you know. What bar? What AI got to say about that? Okay, let's let's hear what it got to say, y'all. I'm processing it. It is unlikely that AI robots will completely take over the barbering industry in the near future. There are a few reasons for this. Barbering is a creative and personal service. Exactly. People often go to a barber because they want a haircut that is tailored to their individual needs and preferences. I can agree An with that. An AI robot <laughs> would likely not be able to provide the same level of personalization as a human barber. Barbering requires a high level of dexterity and precision. AI robots are still not as dexterous as human hands. Okay. And they may not be able to cut hair as precisely or evenly as a human barber. The cost of AI robots is still high. AI robots are still in the early stages of development, and they are relatively expensive. This means that they are not yet a viable option for most barbershops. However, AI robots are likely to play a growing role in the barbering industry in the future. They can be used to automate tasks such as booking appointments, managing inventory, and sending marketing and messages. we talked about that. They can also be used to provide personalized haircut recommendations. As AI technology continues to develop, AI robots may become more affordable and capable, and they may eventually be able to provide the same level of service as human barbers. Here are some of the ways AI robots can... All right, all right, so we heard it. We heard it from AI. I guess right now, as barbers out there, we are in a profession that's pretty much secure. Right now, anyway, in the near future, we pretty much secure from having robots come in and take our jobs, because I'm, I'm sure you guys noticed a lot of the places you go, a lot of the cashiers, they're being taken over by automated cashier machines and, and robots pretty much. A lot of the jobs, assembly line jobs, they're even talking about bringing AI robots into the restaurants to take orders. Instead of you having a waiter, you're going to have an AI robot taking your orders. They're also already talking about AI cooks in the kitchen. So AI robot cooks in the kitchen. So this, this you know... What it said about AI robots taking over the barbering industry, it does give me some a good feeling to know that you know we're not in a, an immediate threat of our industry being taken over by robots. And I I always felt that way because this profession requires you know a lot of skill, a lot of a lot of different type of skills, and a lot of things the brain got to process immediately because every customer is different, every face is different, every head is different every texture is different you know so an AI and robot being able to calculate all that and I'm sure in the future might be able to do that but right now I'm glad to know that we're not in threat of being taken over by the AI business so I'm gonna ask it one last question and I'm just going to off the top want to see if it can answer it I'm gonna say uh who is the best YouTube barber Okay, okay, let me see. Let me see what it says. There are many great YouTube barbers, but some of the most popular and well-respected include 
Chris Basio. Okay. Chris Basio is a barber and educator with over 2.4 million subscribers on YouTube. He is known okay. for his high quality haircut tutorials and his informative Now that's got to be good if you punch that Image in. Of Chris Basio, YouTube barber. 360 GZ. 360 oh, wow. GZ is a barber <laughs> and entrepreneur with over 3.5 million subscribers on YouTube. He is known for his creative haircuts and his entertaining videos on barbering culture. Image of 360 GZ, YouTube barber. The Barber Collective. The Barber Collective is a group of barbers with over 1.5 million subscribers on YouTube. They are known for their educational videos on barbering techniques and their creative haircut tutorials. Image of the Barber Collective, YouTube Barber. Okay, well, AIA, it gives you some good information. I was kind of surprised that it was actually going to come up with some names on who was the best YouTube barber. I'm, I'm kind of surprised. So, if you Chris Basio and you 360 Jeezy and you punch that into an AI program and your name pops up, hey, that means you're doing things out there. That means you're doing big things on YouTube. And, and hey, I, I respect that. I respect them and hey that's that's pretty tight I like that so hey that was my first episode of shop talk shop talk and AI I'm gonna start off my my cuts my videos off with a little uh, shop talk with AI in the future we're gonna get into all kind of questions with Bard and we're gonna see what Bard got to say about the industry before I get into my cuts. so if you like this and I think you really need to share this video because AI is taking over everywhere. You definitely need to share this video. If you like it, definitely give a thumbs up. Definitely share it. Tell me what you think, man. And tell me what you think about Shop Talk with AI. Definitely check me out. Cuts by Dre, New Styles Mobile Barber. Check out my cut on the back end of this video. Hey, peace and I'm out.